This video will guide you through the process of capturing prefetch information for the GIMP app set. In order to complete this video, you will need a computer running Cloud Page and Client on one of the supported Windows operating systems listed on this screen, as well as the GIMP app set files. Prefetching is the process of fetching application pages prior to being explicitly requested by the Cloud Paging player. Unlike conventionally installed applications, cloud paging does not require all application files to be available at all times. Instead, only key pages delivered from the cloud paging server are necessary for the application to launch and perform basic functions. The prefetch file is created by logging pages that are being prefetched when the application is executed. This includes all functions required by the application when the user opens it for the first time. Locally page the most recent version of the GIMP app set. The registry information to install GIMP was excluded from this app set. Open Control Panel and go to Programs. Verify GIMP is not listed. Stop the cloud paging player by selecting Exit from the File menu. Right-click on the icon for Cloud Paging Player and select Properties. Replace dash provider tag equals with slash capture prefetch on the end of the target field. Ensure the C and P in Capture Prefetch are capitalized. Click OK to save the changes. A UAC message may appear. Right-click on the Cloud Paging Player icon and select Run as Administrator. This is optional depending on the user permissions, but should be used if any of the following steps in the remainder of this video are grayed out or fail. A new capture option will now be available on the Player menu bar. From the File menu, select Options and click the Cache tab. Click the Clear Cache option and click Yes on the resulting dialog. This ensures no pages for GIMP are currently in the cache, so they will all be fetched and captured in the prefetch. Leave the dropdown set to Stage 1 and click the Capture button. Save the prefetch file with a .pf extension to any location. The Capture button should now be highlighted, indicating the capture is in progress. Start GIMP, use some basic functions, such as browsing menus, and exit GIMP. Repeat this step three to five times to ensure the prefetch contains the pages most commonly needed for the application to launch. Click the Capture button again to stop the capture. The highlighting will be removed from the Capture button.
verify the prefetch file exists and is larger than zero bytes. Copy the prefetch file to the Cloud Paging Studio system.